Hello guys! Today we will show you how to get electricity out of people. So the energy goes from body. An interesting method. We have found about it during the experiments. Though they didn't expect that. Well, we'll get the electrode from an old battery. Can it be the ancient Indian technology, Anton? What do you think? How did they do it? He has just told us. They have found it occasionally during the experiment. This method. Masochist you are. It is a standard zinc shell cell battery, as we can see. There must be a graphite core inside. A very dirty battery. There was some tar inside. Is it Chinese? I don't know. Let's see. Panasonic? Really? Is it true? What do you think? Made in India. It is Indian. Let's compare. What do you think? Can this company make cells in India? Carbon rod. How do you call it? Carbon? Yes, carbon rod. Carbon troll. Yes, carbon troll. It's a... Positive. 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 Puza, belly. Yes, plus, plus. Yeah, I got it. Plus. Minus. Magnesium? It is magnesium, guys. As you see, if we just touch the voltmeter, nothing will happen. No voltage. No voltage. Uh, magnesium. But if we add a graphite core from a cell and some magnesium, there will appear some voltage. Minus and plus, guys. Plus. Almost 2 volts. 1 in 98. Awesome! Let's try it on. Whoa! It's 2 and 3 volts. Can it really work this easy? Very good. Yes. Very good. Let's try to launch this watch for a test. That is the cheapest watch for 22 rubles. Let's connect the two wires. It's gonna be a super awesome Indian technology. The life hack. How to power your watch using a hand with the energy of your human body, so to say. It can be true. Yeah, I think that is too easy. Have you ever heard about it? Well, um, I tried to make some galvanic couples, but they never gave such a high voltage. And there goes boom! Two volts at once. The watch need one and a half volts. There is even more. Oh my, what is that? Yes, yes. Now let's solder it. Nothing special here. There is plus, below is minus if you don't know, wires are soldered and glued with super glue. Now we tie the graphite core to the red wire. It is going to be the plus. It is not just graphite, it is mixed with carbon. Really? Wait, let's just touch our body with these electrodes. Do you see that? When I was watching that video, I thought it was a fake. I thought that energy we gain from galvanic couples will never be enough. It's amazing. This watch is slightly touching my body and that's enough. Watch are powered with a human body. Can you imagine that? No battery needed. Yes, yes. How would you like the idea if you try to charge a smartphone using this method? He says it is crazy. We're gonna get a biocharger. Do you realize how awesome that'd be? We will never need external batteries. You will be able just take your smartphone and charge it using the energy of human body. If you want to see this, write in the comments and we will make it. So these watch are stealing my energy for 11 minutes already. Can this be dangerous? What do you think? I don't know. No dangerous. No dangerous. Got this? It's safe. It will be charging from your hand until you die. So if I die, it will stop charging. <laughs> Is that harmful? No, no, no. We have minimized the size of the electrodes, and it keeps working still. Yes, yes. <laughs> so the method is real. We can source it from two people, but if we stop being in touch, it stops working. Yes. The electric circuit from two people. Oh my gosh, that is the real electric chemistry. What else can we source using this method? The energy of our bodies. Right, what do you think? Meanwhile, we are going to prepare for the next explosive experiment with carbide. How he is going to extinguish it? I don't get.
Let's go. Let's go home.